prepare for from Oklahoma State to Alcorn and out of Auburn. Right. <laughs> we are. I mean, they're great offenses, and the one that we are going up against, one of the best in the country, Coach Malzahn, Coach Lashley do a great job calling plays, scheming it up. They've got a talented group of running backs, big offensive line, four return starters, and the quarterback is a dynamic player. Fullbacks, big, physical, tough. Um, and the tight ends, you know, some of them look like they're wide receivers out there running around. So they've got a lot of weapons, a lot of talent, so it's going to be a big challenge. The quarterback was playing safety a couple years ago. Does he act and look like a quarterback at this point? Oh, there's two no doubt. I mean, he is fast. He's electric. You know, once he gets in the open field, he's a dynamic player. Um, so he, he's a big challenge for us. Yeah, three running backs, I think, that have 500 yards. If they're 800 total yards, let's talk about those three guys. <laughs> they're, they're, they're a special group of guys. I mean, I got to imagine they're, they're probably the deepest, uh, deepest tailback spot in the conference, and that's saying something. And, I mean, they're all kind of different, different threats. Um, but they're all dynamic players once they get in the ball in their hands. You know, some are built for speed, some are built for power, but they're all legitimate big time SEC backs. Obviously, it helps with your D line depth the way AJ Curtis played this past week. Yeah. Talk about what you saw. Uh, you know, I think Coach Turner, again, I've said a bunch that David Turner's a great D line coach, uh, does a great job developing those kids and, uh, you know, just getting the depth that we have. And we kept rolling them. I think almost every three plays we were rolling them. You know, luckily we were fortunate enough. I think we were 86% three and outs on the day, which is you know what we expect. Um, but the D line had a huge part of that, and the depth at that spot is, is is big for us. I know you want obviously you want the sacks, but still those guys are getting DBUs. And not yeah, they were. You know, the, the big thing that we've stressed the whole time, you know, since January is creating mayhem. And they were getting PBUs, you know, tackles for loss. I think we had eight on the day. I think we've averaged eight. Um, you know, but that's going to be a big challenge, you know, Saturday because they've had such a great offensive line and a set of receivers. What, and backs. What's been your impression of Justin Cox early on? I know that he's wanted to get yeah, some, it, some play. The, my favorite play from Saturday, Coach Mullen, I know y'all couldn't hear it. That's what Coach Mullen just talked about for five minutes. On the kickoff team on Saturday, Justin Cox was the first one down by 10 yards. And it wasn't that other people weren't trying. They were running down too, but just Justin is such a dynamic athlete. And uh, Coach Towns is doing a great job with him, getting him ready. And uh, we expect him to just keep getting better and better every week. I noticed Gabe had a different number on Gabe Miles. He's been getting some looks at the scout team uh, like this week. Gabe's awesome. Gabe's a great kid. <laughs> I think he got a lot of juice points. I, I think he got a special number because of juice points. I don't know. When you look at um, Chris Jones, he joked last after the game saying that he's partially a defensive tackle on a full defensive end. Right. How is this transition kind of going? Well, I mean, just the way Coach Turner teaches it, a three techniques, a five techniques, a nine technique doesn't really change. The twos, the fours, the sevens, all the same thing. And uh, just his development's been great. Um, he, you know, the, some of the plays that he's in, I mean, you can see a physical difference in the, you know, the way the plays are going, you know, things we ask him to do. So he's, he's a, he's going to be a big time player. Obviously, the linebacker 